Hi friends, welcome to my channel RK Vaisin Kids Vlog. Today we will know about glass vase for class 6. So now let's begin. Now let's know about a beaker. It is a glass container with a lip available in varied sizes such as 1000 ml, 500 ml, 250 ml, 100 ml, etc. Now let me show you the lip. So where is it? Yeah, here. This is a lip and this is also a lip. Yeah, the lip is used for pouring out the solutions to that. And the function is that it is used for holding, powering or mixing solutions. Okay. Next we know about measuring cylinder. It is a cylinder with a lip also and available in various sizes such as 1000 milliliter, 500 milliliter, 250 milliliter, 100 milliliter, etc. See? Yeah, this is a 500 milliliter measuring cylinder, 250, 100 liter, and 50 milliliter. Yeah, and it is used for measuring the definite volume of a liquid by filling the liquid to the mark level. See, yeah, and is quite similar with beaker. The only difference is that uh, the beaker's mouth is wide open and it's quite easy to mix the solutions while here in a measuring cylinder it is used for measuring definite volume and its mouth is quite narrow and you know beaker and measuring cylinder also have a lip see let me show you that yeah this is a lip of a measuring cylinder okay yeah okay next we'll know about a conical flask is a conical shaped container available in various sizes such as 500 milliliter 250 milliliter 100 milliliter etc it is known as conical flask because its shape is a, like a cone see yeah <laughs> and it is used for the storage of various liquids and for mixing different solutions okay yeah. hmm? Next, we will know about um, a flat bottom flask. It is used for gas preparation where heating is not required. Okay, not required. And hence, the uniform heat distribution is not necessary. While a round bottom flask, it's another kind of flask, is used for gas preparation also but where heating is required. Okay, since the flask is round bottom, it is uniformly distributed the heat okay the heat is uniformly distributed see how round it is it means its bottom is so round yeah like this okay and see it rolls like this it can't it has to take support by putting a hole in the table and placing that see it's having the support now let me tell you that he, he let's imagine that there is a fire okay it means we are applying heat to a liquid inside a round bottom flask okay yeah and see the heat would be uniformly distributed like this equally the heat would go like this around the sides and the bottom also as it's round but if we heat a liquid in the flat bottom flask yeah here see the heat will be applied more at the bottom than the sides of the flat bottom flask so flat bottom flask is used for gas preparation where heating is not required while in a round bottom flask is used for gas preparation where heating is required okay since the flask is round bottom next we'll know about a test tube stand it's a wooden plastic stand wooden or plastic stand with holes and upright pegs see this is hole these are holes okay a hole a hole yeah and it is used uh, it's used for holding the test tubes the test tubes are kept straight through the holes to hold it okay wash test tubes or cleaned up test tubes can be inverted on the pegs and like this the open end would be down while the closed end will be up okay so that the water runs down in the test tube on the pegs okay next we will know about a funnel 
This is made of glass and available in various sizes and it's used for pouring reactants into the tester funnel or from one vessel to another. It's also used for carrying out the process of filtration during which a filter paper made into a conical shape is wetted and placed inside it. Reactants means if one uh, liquid is mixed with another liquid, some reactions goes inside. So those liquids are um, called as reactants or it may be anything else, okay? Yeah, by pouring the liquids into the funnel which has the filter paper and the filter paper captures the dust and all and the liquid gets filtered and goes into a beaker or conical flask. Next we'll know about the volumetric flask. It is made of glass and available in various sizes. It is used for the presses dilutions and preparations of solutions yeah this is a cap means it's used for closing the volumetric flask and while mixing the solutions yeah it used for process dilutions exact we don't have to check out the measuring uh, measuring cylinder or what we'll just check it out here on the exact it'll, it'll tell there that it is 25 milliliter or uh, 10 milliliter 50 milliliter okay so it's used for mixing also and by closing the cap on the top i showed you now right now yes so this is a one metric flask next we'll know about a funnel stand this is made of wood or plastic and it's used for ho holding the funnel for carrying out the filtration activity yeah i think uh, right now as you know about the funnel we'll know about the funnel stand yeah it's used for carrying the filtration activity see the liquid will go down and go into the beaker or conical flask or something so that the liquid gets filtered <sighs> all right thanks for watching want to see and learn more then just go to my channel arcade vision kids vlog and check out some videos like introduction to science for class six and a leaf biology of classics all right thanks for watching bye